Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Matt, I am the American Canadian Gamer, and welcome back to Hearthstone's Black Rock Mountain. Today we're going to be delving into the next wing that I have yet to do, which is Black Rock Spire. I know I'm a little bit behind on these, but if you saw my update video, you kind of understand why. But I am going to finish them, and we're going to start with Black Rock Spire. Let's see what we have in store for ourselves. And that's my phone beeping, and a reply to a tweet I just sent out. <laughs> All right, what do we have here? Who are you? Greetings, you are Slayer of Ragnaros. Um, what are you doing in Blackrock Spire? Just, just taking the tour, you know, going to see, visit High Lord Almak, just see what he's up to. Me smash, destroy a random damaged enemy minion. Okay, much evil remains in the top half of Blackrock Mountain. Time to climb up. All right, well. Destroy a random damage enemy minion. So a death rattle deck might be good here. Let's try my death paladin deck. A deck I've actually, I was slowly refining up until recently. That's kind of was meant to screw with the very hunter focused meta. Really punish them for being aggressive. Allow me to trade out with their stuff and keep my stuff on board with lots of sticky minions. Maybe it'll work out well here. Maybe it won't. We don't know yet. Those are two good cards. You do not want to be in my hand right now. I can do that. Although that would end up killing my guy as well. Very, very, very hard. Um, yeah. Let's do it. Why are you here? Ragnaros is dead. You should be celebrating with your friends. I have no friends, Novarian. Joke's on you. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> okay. So, uh, let's see. Redemption. Hmm. Hmm. Just gonna cause it to get damaged. Let's do this. If either one of these dies, I'm gonna end up with a, either, you know, something with four attack. I'm gonna end up with something good. Like this. So that gets the event. He's gonna hit that, I bet. Because that's the only thing he has that can trade it. And the redemption gets wasted on that. Oh, that's funny. Oh, that's really. Uh, really? Oh, you have lots of ways to damage... Oh, okay. Alrighty, then. Let's, uh... Throw you in. I have a feeling that it, you're gonna try and clear my stuff out anyway, so I might as well try to go face with this. This is also normal mode, so... no Ragnaros is up here. Your quest is complete. Go... Aw... See, why didn't you hit? And then you don't, you're not making any sense. No sense is being made whatsoever. That was a really good consecrate as well. I'm really happy with that. That is also really good for me. All right. Oh, do I want to belch now? Uh, no, I think now is a good time to start pumping out the armies. The next turn I can throw a big sludge belcher. Get a 4-6 belcher out that he can't one-shot. Oh, okay, he'll one-shot it with that. But I'll just start... Oh, I should have put it over here. That was stupid of me. That's okay. That's okay. One one little mistake's not gonna wreck this entire thing. Not on normal mode. Now, hopefully he doesn't run Brawl or anything stupid like that. Or Whirlwind would hurt a lot right now. Or he's going... Huh. I... Yeah, okay, I can deal with that. I can deal with that just fine. I think you're a good play here as well. So three, 
dose. And dose. Don't see those. Oh. What? Did, are you, like, stupid on purpose? Is that just a thing you do? I'm confused. I am very confused. I think I should kill that. Yeah, because I need trades in and uses his hero power. I do not want to get these guys out. These guys are bad in this deck. These guys are really bad in this deck. It's like, oh, one damage to everything. Yep, then I destroy it. I think I win. I think I win by a lot. What do we get here? BGH. Can I fit it all on board? I can't use my hero power now. Okay, that's fine. There we go. First one down for the count. That was pretty easy. High Lord Omak out of the way. This does not make any sense. I know, right? It's like I kind of know what I'm doing a little bit. It, or at least it gives that impression. Hey, I got the Core Rager. Not really that good of a card, I've noticed. All right, now who do we have? I actually have purposefully. The back button is at the bottom of your screen. I, I I see it, but the choose button is right next to it. I actually have not watched anything on Blackrock Mountain to keep myself in the dark on purpose for this. So Blackrock Spires now, General Dracoseth. Don't let Nefarian fool you. He's a real bad dude. So is Dracoseth. Intense gaze, passive hero power. All cards cost one. Players are capped at one mana. I have just the deck for this. I think. Where is it? No, I don't. I don't have it anymore. Um, I will be right back while I make a deck. Excuse me. I did, I did use the back button after all. Okay, we have a mage deck filled with lots of really high cost things like, you know, Pyroblast and actually Malagos because spell damage plus five. He gets on the field both Pyroblast. It's like there's 30 damage. Could work out well. Maybe. You asked for it. I am playing big things. That's what I'm doing here. I will keep all of those. <laughs> oh, this is going to be really interesting. Really interesting to see what happens here. I might be. I didn't even see what that was. No. What did you just do? Destroy a minion, gain 10 armor. I hear you got a Take three. <laughs> I mean, it got me a minion. Oh, wow. Huh. No, I'm not. He starts with a lot of health, too. Probably because they knew people would do stupid crap like this. I'm bad at ranked mode. And there's my phone going off again. Stop that phone. Are you going to start trying to control the board? There's a core hound. There's a thing that I can just fireball down. Or I can do this instead. And add three more damage to everything. I mean, that's kind of simple. I win. You know what? You don't deserve to be hit by that. Take that. <laughs> yes. Too bad it wasn't a pyroblast. Too bad it was not a pyroblast. That would have made it all the better. Gets annoyed. Alright, what do we have next? Dragon Consort. The next dragon you play costs two less. Turn around, mortal. You are testing powers you do not understand. I disagree. I understand them perfectly. Now we're fighting Rend Blackhand. The entrance to Nefarian's lair is guarded by the ruthless orcs. Led by Rend Blackhand. Two mana. Summon three one one whelps and get a new hero power? Excuse me? What do 
I use against that? Explosions. That's what I use against that is explosions. No way I use custom mage. I wouldn't be able to play anything until turn six minimum, I think is the lowest cost card in that deck is six mana. Yeah, not gonna do that. Oh, perfect. You asked for it. I'll keep the sheep. The sheepy can do thingies. Oh, not... Bah. Humbug. I doubt that. Don't summon your whelps now. Don't do it. No! No, my sheep! Well, the sheep is still a good play. The sheep is my only play. It's a good play. Summon a 3-1 dragon can get a new hero power. So do I just have to control his stuff then? Basically? Is that really what this comes down to? I mean, I can do that. Huh, so it just switches between all those. And you're holding a dragon, you are. That could easily backfire. And it didn't backfire like I thought it would. Oh, do I make it easier for him to take it out? No, because he's probably just going to run it into the him anyways. We'll just do that. What's your power now? 2 one, one orcs with taunt and get a new hero power. Okay, so you're going face. Sounds good to me. Eh, he's gonna die anyways. Maybe he'll be good enough to play something first. Or not. Summon Geeth. Get a new hero. Who's Geeth? What are these things? I don't know what's going on. I don't think I want a flame cannon. Just in case, because I don't know what this Geeth is. That's what Geeth... Okay, I have a flame cannon for that. That's no problem. So... Matter Bomber first. You're supposed to hit that when you jerk. That's okay. He was going to be in the play no matter what. I was just hoping that he would save me some stuff. Like I could just fire blast him. Granted, he could have hit him instead, but it just... Just how things happen. You're still holding a dragon. Holding more dragons. Uh, boom. That's actually good no matter which one it hits. Because then I can do that and that. Granted, you're just going to trade that into that. You're still holding a dragon that you couldn't cast? Hmm. 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 Oh, face. I need to, I, 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 I think I've lost. Oh, I've really lost. Oh, I've really lost. I wield the power of black Oh, oh. Ow. Pain. Agony. Suffering. Lots of pain and agony. Um, hmm. All I can do is clear everything. And even then, I didn't get to do that. I still woefully lose. <laughs> what is math? What is that thing called math? That did not work out at all for me. I thought, hey, I'll get Arcane Explosion. I'll be able to easily deal with his guys and things will be good. No, that was not at all what I thought it would be. So what other decks do I have that could work for that? We have a weird Demon Lock deck. We have Mech Warrior. I don't have any idea what this deck is. We have GGI Win. I'm going to go look at my decks because I forget what half of them are. So I'll be right back.
you know what? Call me crazy, but I think my Death Paladin's the right deck, the right uh, deck for this. I, I like this deck too. This is a deck that I did not model this after anything. I literally just built this from the ground up. So I think, even though it's definitely not like an awesome deck, it's one that I have a ton of love for because I built it from the ground up myself. I'll keep you around. Even though I really should have gone hardcore for the, uh, whatchamacallits. The explosive. Uh, taunt guy. The unstable ghoul. Really should have gone hardcore for that. You're gonna coin into that every time, aren't you? Oh, I can do that. Consecrate won't help me this turn, but it will be really nice when it comes about. That ghoul will be really nice, too. Gosh darn it. No ghoul. This is going to be really painful in the beginning, but the idea is I need to just kind of stabilize, like... You know? Consecrate. Consecrate me. Do it. Consecrate me. <laughs> Woo! All right. And you took damage, so you make a whelp. Right? No? No whelp? <laughs> um, uh, oh, okay, I'll take that. Gladly. Uh, that's a much better play in terms of tempo than the ghoul. The ghoul just kind of delays a hit. And I get that back to life. Hmm. Hmm. Run that into that and that into that. I think is the play. Oh! 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 Bam! Oh, shit! <laughs> well, there's an unstable ghoul that's going to hit for two damage across everything. Although that's not bad because it'll activate my egg and it'll give me two things! What? No! Oh! Dick. Alright. Um. Uh, maybe. Just start putting things into play? Is my best bet at this point? And the next turn, Tyrion Forgering, which if he destroys that, yay for me. What's that, a 3-1? Okay. Ugh, 6-4. Eh, the 6-4 is not a problem. And I'm going to get a 5-5 five five out of that if he goes ahead and kills that. <sighs> yep, I'm not going to get the 5-5 five five anymore. If I get the 4-4, four four, can I get a... I get a dead 4-4. Four four. I got a dead 4-4. Four four. These two in a combination is pretty good, though. So I'm going to hit that. I'm not going to summon the guy just because... Oh my goodness. Oh my. My, my, Miss American Pie. Oh my goodness. So there's 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, jeez. I kind of have to... 9, 10, 11, 12, 12, 13, 4. Oh my goodness. Oh, jeez. I kind of have to take that damage now and I get a 3 3 out of it. I I need to. I don't have a choice. I'm dead. I've been inside that thing for months. 
Played a big old no Oh man, that hurt. That hurt. That hurt a lot. Okay, let's... Hmm. If this hunter deck does it, I'm gonna be a little ticked. Just face hunt... <sighs> we'll see what happens. There's no way this deck could work that well. He just had every answer possible. Ooh, Unleash would be good there. When he just fills everything up and then just Unleash and counter it. Okay. I think I run Explosive Trap. Maybe I just run Snake. Snake and Freezing. Not sure what I run in the deck. Yep, you're going to do that, and I'm going to do this. Let's see here. You can go into play. And you get a car. And you get a car. And Unleash the Hounds is coming. No Unleash the Hounds. Just leave it at that. Good enough for me. Good enough for May. Ah, I'm gonna need that hunter's mark later. I can feel it. I can feel it. Oink. Freezing trap. Uh, sludge belcher. Uh, freezing trap. Go a little more aggressive on him. That that's a little, that's a nice tempo play right there. That'll really throw him off. Belcher this turn is probably the play. Although, eh, kill command is also a good play here as well. Unleash kill. That's also a good play. But I think unleash kill, and then. That is a good play as well. What'd you give me? Freezing Trap. Perfecto. Oh, sweet. Worked out even better than I hoped. That's my, uh, Hunter's Mark target. Right there. That's what that's been saved for. So. Let's do this. Where does the knife go? Good enough. Uh, misdirection. Why not just empty my hand out? That way, in case he pulls some major thing. Oh, wow. This hunter deck, of all things. This hunter deck. Three, five, seven. Yeah, that's that's game. This freaking hunter. Ah. Of course, it's this deck that does it. It's this deck that just wipes the floor with them. Uh, there you go. <laughs> Face Hunter takes out Ren Black Hand. That wing has been defeated. Okay, Mort. You are messing with the wrong dragon. I disagree. I got dragon eggs. Yay. So what do we have here? If you're holding a dragon, destroy a legend. Oh, yeah, that's not really all that great. And the Priest and Druid class challenges are unlocked, which I need to still do. <laughs> I still need to do those. So, everybody, I hope you enjoyed that. Overall, I think that was a pretty successful little run, even though I freaking face hunter is what kills Rend Blackhand here. 
Oh, well, it's normal mode. What are you going to expect out of it? But next time, we'll have Blackwing Lair, and then we'll do the Hidden Laboratory, and then I might do Heroic. Heroic is always really hard for me. I'm not really that good at it, but I might try. I don't know, but I need to do the class challenges as well. So we'll see what happens. But anyways, everybody, I hope you really enjoyed this. I had a lot of fun doing it. So as always, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. My name is Matt, and I'll see you next time.